I got this t-shirt from Van Khade Stadium for free. Anyway, uh, today I'm going to talk about my US application process. I applied to a few colleges in the US, top colleges in the world and got rejected from all of them, of course. So today I'm going to tell you how that experience was, why did I apply to these colleges in the first place and if you guys want to apply then what are the things you got to keep in mind before you even start the application process. So let's do it. Uh, this is how it started, right? So I met uh, 10th grade ho chuka tha mera. in 10th I scored around 97% in my board and uh, I didn't really want to go to a coaching class because I didn't like the atmosphere there, you know, uh, 10th mein mein, by the way, coaching was a lot of like uh, boards ki coaching, so they used to stuff us in a classroom, some 50-60 students sitting in a really tiny classroom and I hated that environment. So in my 11th and 12th grade, my parents said, uh, don't go to a coaching, it's fine if you go to a, go to a normal school. So I didn't go to a dummy school, Ek achhe school ko tha. it's called Ashoka Universal School, amazing school. And now in hindsight, I think not going for coaching was one of the best decisions I've ever taken in my life. Uh, Alright, so in my 11th grade, uh, you know, I'm sitting in the classroom and a seminar hota hai, hai? In that seminar, a guy uh, who got accepted into Princeton University, if you guys don't know, know about Princeton University, then it's, it's like one of the topmost colleges in the US. Uh, he came to our class and he gave a talk about how the application process was and what happened. So essentially, uh, he got, uh, uh, you know, almost full marks in SAT subject tests and SAT, or uh, he got a really high scholarship. So Princeton ki fees is almost 50 lakhs per year, but he got a scholarship uh, because of which he was paying around 2.5 lakhs per year, uh, including everything. So I was like, what? You can go to the US for like 2.5 lakhs per year, that's that's amazing. Starting in one of the topmost uh, colleges in the US for just 2.5 lakhs, that's mind boggling. Uh, I'm gonna do this. Uh, and you know, I, I went to the, I went to sites like, which uh, sites are ranking, KQS rankings karke. And over there almost uh, all the top 50 colleges of the US were ranked higher than IITs. So I was like, this is a really good chance. A lot of people don't even think about it, even I'm gonna apply to the US uh, and I started the process. So I wasn't alone, Mere saath, mera ek aur dost tha. even he was applying abroad, he was applying to the UK, so almost similar process, tha. Dono, uh, test de rete. and a group bana liya tha humne. we were all applying abroad. Ye hua tha 11th ke ending, mein, uh, that was the time when I entered 12th grade. So uh, I was so confident about getting into one of these colleges uh, that I almost gave up on JE mains. So, um, in, in addition to college, I J.E. means that I was studying because I knew that entrances were not going to be So, I was studying J.E. means. I had some online resources. Te. I think Alan ki Fitji had some online resources. I online resource. I used to study from there. And then uh, I just gave up on J.E. I was like, now I'm just going to focus on TOEFL, uh, SAT, SAT subject tests. And that's it. And then I'm gonna apply. And then I'm gonna focus on the application process. Okay. So application process. Ke mein baat, baat mein bolta so let's talk about the first exam, TOEFL. TOEFL. Uh, it's a simple exam. Hai. It's just to test that you have English or not. So I scored 116 out of 120. Usme verbal bhi rehta hai. So uh, that, that was pretty easy. Then SAT. Uh, SAT. Mein I scored 1440 out of 1600. And then for SAT subject tests. I scored 2330 out of uh, 2400. Uh, these are decent scores, but uh, it's not enough to get into the, these top colleges. Now, I'll tell you the colleges that I was planning to apply to. First was Harvard, MIT, uh, Stanford, I wasn't sure of, Duke, Dartmouth, Cornell, uh, University of Pennsylvania, Princeton, and Brown University. Brown University is where Emma Watson and all studied. Anyway, so uh, these were the universities that I was planning to apply. Remember, these are very, very expensive. On an average, you have to pay around $100,000 a year to, uh, you know, be in one of these universities. I was banking on scholarships. I thought ki th scholarship agar mil jayega, then I would be able to afford it. And that was the only thing I was banking on. So uh, also I was inspired by the other guy's story, right? Uh, who got into uh, Princeton. Also I had a friend who got into Harvard with a great scholarship. So these were my role models there and I thought it would be pretty easy. But soon I realized that my friend was in Princeton. Wala, India mein se sirf saat log gaye the Princeton in India only 7 people were in Princeton in 2018. So that's so competitive, right? In a country with 1.3 billion people, only 7 people were in Princeton University. MIT didn't have anyone from India that year. So zero people were in MIT from India. 
and Harvard uh, chose five students from India to uh, you know go and study uh, in the university. It's it was so competitive, and I don't know what I was thinking, but I thought I, I thought I have a good shot. Uh, now uh, the thing is, whenever you apply to foreign universities, there are two aspects to it. The first one is academics. Academics, when I told you, TOEFL, SAT, or SAT subject is, my scores are not that good. The second one is extracurriculars. Now, if your academics is uh, decent, then you can compensate for that by having extraordinary extracurriculars. So, I, my plan was that my score is not so good. So, let's try to pull off the uh, extracurriculars part. If I have done something very good, I, I might get into one of these colleges, right? So, uh, that was my plan. Then, I started participating in a lot of competitions just for the sake of my resume. So, I didn't have any intention, I didn't have any intrinsically motivation, but I had to add an application that I had to participate in this, that was it, that was it. Then I started participating in random Olympiads, which I didn't have any interest, but just for the sake of this application, I was participating in this. And then I came across a competition called Makerspace, okay? So it was a global competition where you had to build stuff, you could make anything, and then you had to make a tutorial about how you built it. Then we made uh, chicken incubators, we made uh, you know solar powered uh, lamps, we made a lot of a bunch of things, uh, and uh, you know some water level uh, indicator things like this. So many we worked on all these projects and started submitting it for the competition. It was a global competition, so uh, even universities were participating. We were in our twelfth grade, and many team were made from school, and we were participating in this competition. Now, uh, believe it or not, we were in the top 10 global teams after participating in it. And I didn't even, like, I was not motivated to participate in it, but for just college applications, ke liye I did that. And then I realized, hey, in the name college application, ke naam pe, I'm going out of my way and doing crazy things that I never thought would be able to do. So, Makerspace, top 10 global teams, that, that was a big thing, right? So, uh, we got a lot of goodies, a lot of t-shirts, uh, equipments, so sub, uh, they sent it from the US. Uh, in fact, the shipping charge itself was $200. So, in it, like the, the total value of prices might be around $1000. So, that's the uh, great part about it. So, we won that. And then uh, I thought, this is not enough. I got to do something more. So, uh, there's something called Tech Fest that happens in IIT Bombay. Uh, and uh, if you guys don't know, I, may, I told you, right? I made an incubator. So, incubator is basically a box through which you can hatch chickens. I actually hatched few chickens using an incubator. So uh, I, you know, uh, usko modify kar diya tha. I, I said ki this will help farmers get better income. I said I modify kar diya and I applied to Tech Fest at IIT Bombay. I don't know how, but I got selected in the top 20 teams at IIT Bombay. So uh, I went there and presented uh, my incubator in front of professors at IIT Bombay. I think I was one of the youngest over there and uh, yeah, that's that. So, I got a tag that I was in the top 20 finalists at IIT Bombay ke Tech Fest. So, these were the two things, two major things that I did. Uh, in this case, I had many Olympiads diye te, just to fill up the application. Once that was done, it was time for the application. Theke? So, you have to write essays, and these essays are very strange. It means that you have to retrospect about your life, that when you were happy in the life, when were you depressed the most, when did you cheat on someone, when was the last time you hacked in your life. It means that you have to write a lot of strange questions, and I typed in these essays. I spent like two months in just doing these essays, and I typed in these essays. I spent like two months in just doing these essays, I had a lot of time wasted. I left J.A. Mains like that. Like 90% of my time used to go in these college applications and SAT, SAT subject as preparation. Uh, I don't know if it was a good decision or not, but I don't regret it. So, these are all things and then uh, I applied. Now remember, application cost is expensive. Each application uh, costed me around $100 and I ended up spending around 70,000 rupees in just applying to colleges. So bus application form mein I spent around 70,000 rupees. There's something called the Common App. Uh, the Common App is like a common platform through which you can apply to a lot of colleges. Uh, so that's what I did. Now uh, I had one, an interview with uh, like a, a Princeton alumni. So he called in from uh, California. We had the uh, call on Skype and uh, he was pretty impressed with the things that I did. 
and usne mujhe confidence di diya tha ki i would get in he was like uh, i think you have a really good shot at it and uh, you might get in to uh, i was happier uh, kyunki i thought ki i already got a seat in princeton but then later uh, on the day of uh, the results i got rejected from each and every one of these colleges all of these top colleges kyunki i already told you right ki saat paanch log hi jaate hain india se uh and i don't know what i was thinking but sare colleges i was rejected so now my only option was j mains j advance and bitsat these were the only three options i was left with uh if i don't do any one of these then i am screwed in life so uh, i was like okay uh, now let's focus on bitsat uh and j mains started studying for those two uh j mains i screwed up real bad uh, my rank was on 40000 in j mains uh, terrible bitsat i uh put in full focus and somehow within a month i was able to finish the portion and uh, i got 300 out of 415 bits set which i think is quite decent and then uh, this thing uh, j advanced i think i got around 19000 or 20000 rank in j advanced that was it uh, so uh, uh, as i told you i applied to bits through two methods right one is through bits set and the other one is through isa so through bits set i was getting eni and through isa i was getting ec i chose ec and i got a seat in bits i was happy about it and then r- right after i got a seat in bits i realized that even bits is a bit competitive bits ka jo acceptance uh, uh, rate hai it's around 0.01% or princeton ka acceptance rate is around uh, 5% so i texted my interviewer saying hey i got rejected from princeton but i got into bits which has a less acceptance rate and even he was like yeah that's great uh, to wo ho gaya tha uh, i uh, do i regret not going to the us actually no i love bits and it's pretty amazing by the way bits has been inspired from mit to jo dome rahega bits goa ka it's similar to mit dome if you ever noticed that so i love bits i have great friends there i'm working on a couple of projects and it's a, it's a great experience so uh, that was my story of applying abroad had i gone abroad i think i would have spent way more than what i'm spending right now because us is very expensive and now during time of covid i'm happy that i didn't go abroad i would have been stuck in the us and would have been pretty screwed theek hai to i'm happy that i am safe at home yeah my heart goes out to everyone who stuck in the us so that was it aur mere jo dost the right jo mera dost tha jiske sath main apply kar raha tha he got 1200 now i'll tell you um, i got rejected in spite of good scores because i applied to really competitive colleges theek hai but the chance of you getting accepted in lower colleges is very high to mai if i had applied to university of texas to aaram se mil jata tha berkeley aaram se mil jata tha so uh, i think these colleges are easy to get in but you'll have to shell out more cash of course to mera jo dost tha usko sat mein 1200 mila tha usne sat subject test bhi nahi diya aur toefl bhi nahi diya and uh, he applied to the uk right now he is in uh, university of leeds uh, kuch hi din usse video call pe baat hui thi and uh, unfortunately he stuck in the uk uh, yeah so he wasn't able to book his flights back uh, and that's that so ironically uh, this time jab maine uh, do char panch mahine pehle tedx talk diya tha to uh, yaad hai maine pehle bola tha ki one of my friends was like howard make banda tha and i got inspired by him him and i uh, were there for the tedx talk to dono ka event same day pe tha yeah so life is pretty different guys um, like if you don't get accepted into us colleges then don't get disheartened it's fine maybe that's how god has planned life for you so it's never the end ठीक है मैं आई गॉट स्क्रूड मुझे एक दो महीने में जेई मेन सर बिछा देना था सो दैट्स दैट एंड आल्सो आई गेव बोर्ड्स आल्सो राइट तो बोर्ड्स में आई स्कोर 95.6 परसेंट एंड दैट्स इट गाइस सो आई होप यू गाइस गॉट अ ब्रीफ आइडिया अबाउट हाउ थिंग्स टर्न आउट हाउ माय इलेवेंथ एंड ट्वेल्थ वेंट आई एम रियली हैप्पी बिकॉज मैं मतलब ज्यादा एक्स्ट्रा करिकुलस कुछ करता नहीं था नाइन्थ और टेंथ में आई वॉज अ घोट बस पढ़ाई करता था पर लेवेंथ और ट्वेल्थ में आई वेंट आउट ऑफ माई वे आई डेड अ लॉट ऑफ एक्स्ट्रा करिकुलर्स एंड विच हेल्प मी इम्प्रूव माई कम्युनिकेशन स्किल्स एंड गेव मी लॉट ऑफ सॉफ्ट स्किल्स तो दैट दैट हेल्प मी इन माई यूनिवर्सिटी सो दैट्स इट गाइज डू गेट इंट एक्स्ट्रा करिकुलर्स इट्स वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट मेक्स यू हैप्पीअर मेक्स यू गेट गुड लीडरशिप स्किल्स एंड मेक्स यू कैन अ सक्सेसफुल इन लाइफ सो दैट्स माई टू सेंट्स ऑन अपलाइंग टू द यू एस आई सी यू द नेक्स्ट वन 
also 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 sub subscribe to my channel uh, click on the link to get mentored by students of Bitspilani and also there's a link for uh, getting skills and you know working on life projects so click on that link even that's going to be pretty cool we're building something amazing for you guys so stay tuned tata bye